She would lay hands on her stomach, and she was told that her son would do a great work for the Lord. Right. Right. After Joseph was born, they knew something was different about him. He was standing on the church pew and saying the word hallelujah all the time. All right. He grew up in a very quiet and wise little boy. He grew up a quiet, wise little kid. In Urbana, he went to the elementary school at Thomas Paine and finished his last two years at the elementary school at Yankee Ridge. He went to the Urbana Middle School and attended Urbana High School. As a child, he would help his mother take care of his little brother and sort of made himself the man of the house. All right. All right. One day, his older brother, Jeffrey, offered the family to go to church, and they all agreed. It was there, it was there Joseph wasn't feeling the church thing. He was into cursing, secular, secular music, and just like a teenager. But one day, he decided to sit down and hear the preacher preach. And finally, he opened up his heart to the Word of God. My God. Oh. At the age of 13, he got saved, and he got filled with the Holy Ghost as well. Yeah. He has been a very important part of many churches that he has been to. He has been part of the Church of the Living God, the Seventh-day Adventist Church, Glory Center International, where he was an armor bearer for Apostle C.D. Nesbitt, mm -hmm. the Truth Pentecostal Holiness Ministries, where he was the keyboardist for Pastor Charlotte Bislett, I'm sorry, listen. Mm -hmm. Also, Grove Street Church of God in Christ, where he served as an armor bearer for overseer Elder Robert L. Perry, Jr. Then he moved to the Kingdom Connection Outreach Center in Urbana, Illinois, where Davida Bernard was the, is the pastor. He also belongs to the Noel Brown and Company, a group of talented singers in the Champaign Urbana, under the leadership of his father figure, Minister uh, Noah I. Brown. He currently serves as the ordained leader at New Generation Christian Fellowship under the spiritual father, Apostle Larry C. Simmons, and also co-pastor Kim Simmons. He is known as the youngest ordained clergyman in the Champaign-Urbana area in ministry. He has changed the lives of many young people as well as older people. From his monthly youth services, he organized a group called YPPM, which is Young People Praising Ministries, mm -hmm and the Youth Explosion where he hosts that new generation in July. Now he's on his way to college in Springfield, Missouri yes. um, at Evangel University, majoring in media and broadcasting. He's on his way to do many great things yes. for the kingdom of God and to change the world. Yes. And one of his sayings is, it's not about me, it's about God and his people. Right. And on a personal note, I want to say that he has been like a son to me, okay. so I'm going to really miss him. <laughs> Um, we haven't had many conversations together, and I value him. I value that he is on fire for God, oh, yeah. and he's a man of God. Oh, yeah. So please pray for him as he continues his um, journey um, and his college. God bless you all. Amen. 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 We're going to put our hands together again and break down. That short bio that is quite a resume for a young man, Amen. Amen. especially in this day and time when uh, uh, you know we're, we're so busy trying to 